Harlan? Are you all right? I just needed to hear your voice. One more time. One more... Don't hang up. Don't hang up, Carly. You can hear my voice every day for the rest of your life if you just tell me where you are. Listen carefully, Jack, okay? Because I don't have much time. I love you, Jack. I always have. Get a trace on this call. I love you too, Carly. Which is why I'm doing everything I can to bring you home. It's not important anymore. I don't believe that. And neither do you. Tell me where you are so, so I can come get you. This has gone on long enough. Well, it's over now, Jack. At least for me. speak freely, yes or no? I realize it's difficult to answer questions, but if I say the country... I've been thinking you... about us a lot, Jack. How hard we tried to make it together, and how... it never quite worked out. There, there are a lot of reasons for that. Too many to get into now. I, I want you to know that I know it wasn't your fault, Jack. Maybe... I didn't think I deserved you. But it was the most wonderful dance, Jack. And you were the best partner a girl could ever have. We can try. We can try it again. Just as soon as you get home. I'd like... I'd like you to do me a favor. When this is over... I want you to remember the good times, Jack. And the joy. And try your best to forget about everything else. Do you think you could do that for me? It would make me happy knowing that you did. Nothing is over, Carly. I'm gonna find you and I'm gonna bring you home. That's enough. I have to go now, Jack. Be good to yourself. Bye. Get back on the phone, you've got to tell me where you are. Feel better now? No. No. Come on, ring. Did you get it? Hospital, they admitted Hal into the psychiatric ward. Yeah, how's he doing? Well, Dr. Michael said he's been brainwashed, so she's bringing in a specialist in thought reform. It's what they used to call deprogramming. Let's pray it works. Yeah, well, we can only wait and see. What's going on here? You don't look so good. I got a call from Carly. Oh, that's wonderful. Did she say where she was? No. Did you get a trace? We weren't on long enough, which is why I'm flying to Europe tonight. Europe? Well, that's a big place. I'll start at the graveyard. In Brussels, the one where, where the spa is dumping bodies. I'll wait for the next delivery. Uh -huh. You're going to make me say this, aren't you? Don't bother. I'm going. Jack, <sighs> Abigail Williams' trial is coming up. Hal is out of commission. I don't know when you know, he's going to... Margaret, I'm, I'm, I'm trying real hard not to be rude here, okay? But I'm not even listening to you. To tell All you right, the truth. listen to me. The, the, the authorities in Brussels are on this case. If there's a break, they'll handle it. Then you can jump on a plane. No, I am not okay? waiting another minute longer. Not for one more person, not for one more case. Carly needs me now. Jack, do you want to at least tell me what you said? In a word? Goodbye. What? 
She thinks she's going to die, Margo. She wanted to speak to me one last time. Wait a minute, are you sure about that? You, in her words, when it's all over, try to remember the good times and do your best to forget everything else. I can't let her fade on me like that, Margo, not without a fight. Right, then you better hurry. Might be faster if I take a cruiser to the airport. Detective Snyder needs a cruiser out front now. Go. I'm coming. What happened? You missed your plane? Yes. Jack, I seem to have misplaced my passport. Hmm. But it doesn't matter. Because, you see, having dual citizenship, I can always use this. Montega. Claro que si. My daughter was kind enough to bring it down to me. Hello, Detective. How are you feeling? Not bad, considering. So, I, I guess you're planning on taking the next flight to New York. The thought did cross my mind, yes. Well, then we'll see each other on the plane. You're going? Since when? Since Carly called me at the station tonight. Hey, was she all right? What, what did she say? It's a long story, Craig. I'll, I'll fill you in after we take off. Attention passengers on flight 412 to New York will begin boarding momentarily through gate B11. Please have your boarding passes available for inspection. Yeah, that's us. Nice seeing you again. Montgomery, you coming or not? Not going, Jack. Stay here with my daughter. <laughs> I understand. Oh, uh, Jack, wait, what, what did Carly say? It was very brief, Craig, but she sounded okay. Yeah. Think she was harmed or anything? She didn't mention anything about it, no. Did she ask about Craig, me? Uh, it was a quick call. We didn't get into specifics. back here without her. Sorry for the delay, ladies and gentlemen. Flight 412 is now ready for boarding. Hang on, Carly, I'm on my way. Yes, I just wanted to make sure I, I have two tickets for the way home, one for me and one for Carly Tenney. You're all set, Detective Snyder. Check straight through to Brussels. Thank you. You were right, darling. Detective Snyder has booked a flight to New York with a connection to Brussels. All right, Hilda, you... You keep an eye on him. I will get things ready on this end. 